Gemini, it's L here to do your mid-April 2019 general reading. So it's a general reading, so it will not resonate with each and every Gemini who views the video. But if it does resonate with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated. Alright, Gemini, so it's a lot going on. Um... Let's see. I'm hot. Ooh. Lord. Okay. Um, thank you to those who like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It's much appreciated. Uh, we'll say the announcements to the end. Let's pull some cards. Uh, and, and the phone is going off. Hang on, guys. Okay, so we just put the phone where we can't hear it. You know? All right. Thank you, Lord God, for blessing us with the messages for Gemini. What do you want to tell Gemini? What's going on? We'll do past, present, future. Right. Gemini. What's going on in the past for the Gemini? The three of pentacles in the past. So in, the, in your recent past, it may have been some legal issues, some legal woes, some contracts. Uh, maybe even you getting recognition or you wanting recognition you building towards something uh, working on your, your craftsmanship your your skill here I'm trying to put something together in in a form of documentation or documents or business plan something like that um, yeah I don't necessarily want to say it was a third party situation. It could be. We'll see what's going on. Uh, okay. Presently. Let's see. Presently. Presently we are. Where are my Gemini's? The Eight of Wands. Okay. So we're, we're trying to press forward. Trying to move forward. Eight of Wands. Talks about needing to have the strength to either communicate. Communicate about the trouble or the jealousy in a an existing relationship. This could be romantic friendship uh, at at the job, but it's it's about having the strength to um, push something f along by way of firstly communicating, uh, having the energy to do so. The ones are about growth, so it's about pushing along, pushing forward, growing this. Either we're taking it to the ten of wands, or we're going to reduce it. Maybe to the seven of wands, to the six of wands, to where, you know, everybody's happy and there's, you know, victory here or somewhat. But whatever it may be or whichever way it goes, it's about, firstly, ha taking the the action to do so, to move forward or backwards. Mm -hmm. Let's see. In the near future, some of you may be traveling to... And then would be back and forth communication about maybe these contracts, some legalities, some documents, you know, not face to face communication. In the near future, in the near future, the Gemini is what? In the near future. Six of Pentacles. All right. So in the near future, you are at a place of. of any quality of needing to make the choice. You may be you may have your hands in two different things. You may be giving energy, effort, time, money to two different two very real options here. Or someone around you is doing that. There may be trouble. If not trouble, there's um problems in an existing relationship. This could be a second relationship, a second marriage. Doesn't have to be, but there's problems due to inequality. The bottom of the deck, we have the the Empress. Uh, this could be the other woman with the Three of Pentacles. I, I, I don't want to say that. Um, let's go ahead and clarify. Bottom of the deck, the Empress. So this is all about what you're creating. The threes, the Empress is a three card. The Three of Pentacles, what you are putting 
effort, money, time, the tangible into, in, in the intangible, work, sweat, uh, brain power, what you're creating for yourself. Um, let's see what's going on here. What is the Three of Pentacles in the past for the Gemini? The Three of Pentacles in the past for the Gemini. The King of Wands. You may have felt like you were... Some of you are putting energy, effort, and time into becoming entrepreneur. This is an entrepreneur endeavor. You need to do the the paperwork, the 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 physical of getting a business together, or getting off the ground. But some of you, give me one more card. Page of Swords. Yeah, definitely doing research, gathering up, you know, research about information, getting more information about making something happen in in terms of um, maybe going into business for yourself the king of wands what you desire um, what you want I want to make this happen by way of contract documentation business plan therefore I do the research I gather more information If not, this is if this is relationship for some of you, it is um, you may be with this is typically the cancer man. You may be spying on him because you feel as if he's he or she is still um, embarking on some third party situation. Maybe with this individual here, the lady. Also, I'm hearing that somebody feels as if they may have put you on the pedestal. Now they they want to kind of like pull the rug from under you. They're, they're done doing that. What is the Eight of Wands presently? Eight of Wands presently. Queen of Wands definitely for some of your relationship. Um, if not, this is... This is uh, presently my Gemini's are getting busy. See, the Queen of Wands takes action. She's the go-getter. She's the multitasker. She talks to people. She's out there. She gets a lot of uh, um, attention. You may be getting a lot of attention, whether it's in, you know, ro romantic, or you just may be out here trying to make things happen. In in the terms of, I'm trying to pull together, you know, uh, this business idea. And uh, make it happen for myself. Give me one more card for the Eight of Wands and the Queen of Wands. Definitely. Okay, two cards came out. Three of Wands and the and the Magician. Something about some somebody knows they're kind of like being manipulated in a situation. I'm just waiting for truth to come out waiting for things to turn to tide to turn that's one way some of you once again doing the work or having done the work now you're waiting for things to come back to you maybe even waiting for a response in regards to maybe submitting paperwork doing something you're using everything that you have in your in your willpower in you to actually manifest this one more card for the present. The lovers, then you come out. Yeah. You, you have made the life altering choice. And this could be in love. This could be just in career and finance. The life altering choice. The choice. Uh, there, there was two, as you see, six of pentacles. You guys govern the sixes. The lovers is the sixth card. We got the six of pentacles in the near future. You're going to have to make a decision about, you know, you can't keep dividing yourself like this. You have to choose the choice. All right. In the near future, we have the six of pentacles. Also, you know, with the six of pentacles, they can also talk about 
the oncoming depletion. You can put yourself in a place of the Five of Pentacles. Um, or, or it may even be at the Seven of Pentacles and trying to evaluate. Well, I should be further along now. Well, you should be if you weren't giving to, to their real options. Yep. You're going to have to make the choice to end something. Have a final ending here. The worst is over in this situation. The Ten of Swords. Maybe with another air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. It'll just it'll just be your energy. Let's see. Queen of Cups. Maybe something to do with love. Love for self. Taking the cup back and, and putting it in on self here. Letting something completely in. Some of you are or were in third party situations. And you need to make the choice. Are you going to continue on this path? Or, um... Or are you just going to let it end here? Some of you with career and finance, you may have to end a job and go after what it is fills you on a soul level, emotionally. Okay. Uh, the Queen of Wands. See, presently I was talking about somebody's waiting for some truth to be revealed. They already know the truth. Somebody's holding on to the fact that they know. The Queen of Wands knows. She's, her intuition is high. Uh, somebody knows something. But I just feel an air of just burying your head in the sand. Kind of letting it catch up to you. You already know. But yeah, justice. So some of you may have to... Um, Go down to the court system. You're hesitating before doing this. Five of Cups and then the Five of Pentacles. Lots of change within a long-standing dynamic institution. Institution of marriage, corporation. Uh, tradition, religion. Lots of change here. You see and you feel something different. You're hesitating before actually moving, making that decision to move. Five of Pentacles. Not feeling very abundant. There's not a lot of confidence here in the near future about maybe something pressing forward. What is this about? Queen of Swords. Yeah, you, you are helping on getting the truth, giving the truth. Um, and having a new start in health, happiness, and wealth for yourself. Queen, definitely some of you worry about uh, your physical, your physical well-being. The second or third opinion about something. Some of you, yeah, you, of course you're worried about money, but definitely your physical. Three of Swords. It just looks like a situation, High Priest is at, at the bottom of the deck, or you're just really contemplating divorce and or separation due to maybe infidelity. This is our third three. There, there is, um, <laughs> okay, thank you, Spirit. What you don't have in this reading are fours. Fours are about stability. You and your person can't get out of the threes, the three of pentacles. Three of Wands, the Three of Swords. You can't get out of the creation stage. The Empress. You can't get out of the creation stage. What you're creating now, it's falling apart. The Three of Swords. We all hope to skip over the Three of Swords. Uh, especially in romantic endeavors. Some of you, this will just be departing from one way of maybe earned income a job a career and and going out on your own and doing it for real and putting a lot of energy effort and time behind it some of you it's departing from a love relationship you can't get over okay now we're here and it's, it looks good now can we get to the four can we get some stability here no we can't do that because you know Somebody won't make the choice 
of lovers of who they want to give their love to energy effort and time to yeah let's see what the advice is for the Gemini what's the advice for Gemini Okay, Gemini, the advice that flew out was the Three of Cups. We want another three. There's our fourth three judgment in the Four of Swords. It says that you need to, what you're creating here, um, this third party, maybe a third party situation, you're not the only person in this energy. And that's why you come up as the Five of Cups and Five of Pentacles. You kind of knew and you know, you had an inner knowing that somebody held the torch or the flame for something or somebody else even though they were putting you on that pedestal now they're trying to snatch it back uh you would have to be final about your decision about this person and and moving forward three of cups judgment um are you doing it are you okay with it are you done with it uh whatever the decision is know that you can heal from it four of swords know that truth and clarity comes from uh, meditation prayer if you need to pray about this definitely okay so the advice here oh, okay um, i think the cards are reversed here yeah. it's justice again um, you may have to kind of do what's fair and just for you okay all right so that's the advice let's pull an angel answers card and then let's let's go over to my website and clarify and see how this other person is feeling or if this is a career-based reading for you if it's resonating on that level let's see how it turns out in regards to me you may be choosing to be um to go out into some entrepreneurial endeavor okay all right so let's see All right. <laughs> oh, so we have romance. Remain positive. If you believe, look for a sign. Okay, so we're gonna clarify these over the in my website. The reading is two dollars. If you feel like it's resonating with you thus far, you need a little bit more clarity. Um, and you can't afford a full on personal reading, or you just aren't at a place where you want to do that. Two dollars gets you a bit more clarity. Especially the romance card. We do have the lovers here. It might be somebody else in your energy. Now, you may be the person doing that with two people. So, I don't know. Or three people. Um... Okay, so let's go over to the website. All right, Gemini, thank you for tuning in. Know that I am praying for you. Pray for me as well. Take care, guys. Um, talk to you soon.